Okay, here we are, Smellbads Gaming in World of Tanks. I'm thinking I'm gonna play a medium for a few games. Um, my go to mediums are the T34, the Russian tier 5, the Matilda, the standard one, not the uh, what you mean, who's it? Not the premium one, the Russian premium one, uh, but I like I like this one here. Uh, let's go into it. It's a f awesome tank. I love it. I absolutely love that tank. What else have we got here? Anything? No, no. I also love the uh, T-28. It is, in in my opinion, a very underrated tank, which is why it's got full camo uh, that is purchased with real money but it's a keeper I'm keeping it forever and it's already got a really good um, camo rating so adding extra camo makes it even better and it's got quite a quite a nice gun on it you know it's pretty good pen for a tier 4 medium I play it like a tank destroyer I don't play it like a medium but you know I could play it like a bucket and I'd probably s Someone else would probably still play it better. So, what are we going to play today? I think... I haven't played the Japanese one for a while. Uh, let's see how much research it needs. Quite a bit. Yeah, I don't think I want to... I don't really want to faff about with that. Go back. Um, I haven't played the Panther for a while, I don't think. Um, I actually, I played it a couple of weeks ago, but, hmm, what to play, what to play, what to play? Ah, uh, the D2. That's good for shit and giggles. How much research is left on that? Gosh, it's actually ready to be elited. Oh, okay. Oh well, I know what we're going to do. We're going to buy the B1. Are we going to buy the B1? Should we buy the B1? Let's buy the B1. Um, uh, my money's getting low but we'll give them 75% crew. I don't think I've got a crew for it. Actually, we'll purchase without a crew and just double check to see if I've got a crew that can pop into it. Um, Except that's a heavy. Why did I buy that? I don't want to play a heavy. I want to play a medium. The T34. Oh look, let's just go with the trusty Matilda because you know it's it's a scrubs weekend. It's times three XP. Not as bad as when it's a times five XP. That's really bad. What I like about the uh, Matilda is it's a go slow tank and it really suits me because, you know, I don't think very quickly on my feet. That's why I don't play games like Call of Duty. I used to play um, Counter-Strike quite a lot. In fact, I think I've got 17 and a half, no, how many hours? Seven Over 1700 hours in Counter-Strike and I'm still absolutely useless at it. Absolutely. I just... Oh, I'm just terrible at it. I mean, I'm going to blame my ping for the fact that I can't react fast enough. You know, 142 ping is the best I can get to the US servers in this game. Counter-Strike, I didn't have that excuse because it was local New Zealand teams, uh, servers, sorry. So, oh, this is taking a little bit time to load what's these messages down here uh, XVM is updated oh yeah we bought that don't know why I bought that I'm an idiot I don't like the French tanks I think they suck not that I've got many of them but everything I've seen about them I just don't like so hey finally we get a game on Siegfried line oh if I go the wrong way in a Matilda, well, quite frankly, we're stuffed. What's this little symbol next to us? What's that symbol? 
I don't recognise that symbol. Does that mean that we're XVM users? Is that what that symbol means next to our name? I've not seen that before. What does it mean? Watch out for these guys because they're crap. That would explain why I've got one next to my name. Um, okay, I don't want to be on this side. I want to be in the town. I like the Matilda going in towns. Um, it's such a... What's the word for it? Well, in town you can really maximize the Matilda's armor which is you know pretty good um, I mean, this is a tier 5 game the Churchill 1 and the KV ones can really really wreck me uh, the T1 depending on what gun they've got that could be a problem um, the T14 uh, I don't think I have many problems with the T14 if I can recall rightly pretty sure I'm a safe bet on that now what I'm gonna do is play three games whether or not they are good or bad they go up on YouTube um, that is my plan I've decided that's a nice format for me because my plane is hit and miss. Sometimes you'll get bloody awesome games from me. Other times you will get absolute terrible games. Okay, what's going on here? By the time I get there, everyone will be dead because that's... Okay, where, 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 where are they? <laughs> what's going on here? Have we got Artie? Yeah, we've got two Arties. Now, uh, Arties are always a problem. What's he doing? Right, so we've got a Churchill. Can we shoot anything? No. I really need to look at the map more and, and figure out what the hell I'm doing because uh, anything over there? No. Now that Churchill, um, can I get him somewhere else? No. No. Oh, come on. I'm going to get nowhere in this. I'm, I'm not even going to shoot anything at this rate. get anything? No. Oh, this is pretty pathetic. I mean, I... <laughs> One of the problems is it takes me so bloody long to get anywhere in this thing. And then I'm a lousy shot as well, which doesn't help. But basically we're bullying these guys. I can actually... Oh, don't go in front of me like that, please. Jesus. Now that's the weak spot. That much I know. He's taking care of them, stopping them moving. Go for his cupola. Oh, I thought I was going to get a little bit more damage there, but... Oh well, it is what it is. Don't reverse please, because you'll wreck me. What's going on here? Did we win already? Ha! <laughs> I didn't realise we were doing that well. <laughs> well that was a quick game. Um, how did we do? Uh, well, oh that's damage. Hoo hoo, nearly at the bottom. Um, bottom of the middle. <laughs> Oh well, it is just one of those things. 11 hits. 
Oh, I got a third class mastery for that? Um, okay. Yeah, that that's not my best performance in a Matilda. I, I can actually play the Matilda sometimes reasonably well. So we're going to jump back into it since that was a win. I really enjoyed that. It took me ages to actually find anywhere to get to. But, you know, it's a Matilda. It drives at, what, 20 kilometers an hour. But it can do damage. Um, and, you know, shooting, uh, what was it, an 88 or 85 or whatever, I can't remember what it was now. Um, taking its track out, which I tried which and failed. Um, but shooting its cupola, if you, if you actually aim at it, like I was doing for a change, then you can actually do, you can wreck them. Especially if they can't turn. Um, and that's why you take the, uh oh. This is, this is, oh dear. By the time I get to the town, which is again my preference. But anyway, back to that AT. If you go for the cupola like I actually managed to do, you can, you can do a lot of damage to them. Um, the rest of their armor, uh, I'm not sure if the Matilda can pop, pop their armor. Um, I can't actually remember. But, you know. I did a little bit of damage. Had I not taken 10 years to actually get to where their fighting was, this one's going to take 20 years by the looks of it. I'll be an old man by the time I get over there. But what we do is we keep our gun pointed that way in the hopes that something gets lit up. Actually not the O not I because we don't want to shoot our own team. I don't, I don't know why that happens but it's a bit ridiculous really so we're wandering over and we use this little dip over here so that hopefully they can't see us and once we're in town we can sort of control what happens well that's how I play anyway but look this great big behemoth of a thing is faster than us. I'm trying to catch up to it and I can't. <laughs> now can I get him? I could if I could shoot through the dirt. Um, no. Yeah, I don't go that way because pretty much every time I've gone over that thing I either get stuck or I break my tracks. So those are bigger tanks, they can clearly do it. So what I'm doing is I'm going to almost snipe in this instance. I'm going to come up here and hopefully, all going well, there will be no enemies up here because they've seen all the other ones come up there. There's a KV down there uh, and a Matilda. And I'm going to try 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 and side scrape and see if I can keep my armor angled and try and shoot something um, I find the Matilda is quite good at sniping uh, a lot of people oh that's a tog I've not seen a tog for a while come on poke it poke poke out little toggy Alright, we're not actually achieving much here. Um, I think we'll just have to bite the bullet and go up. We're winning 6-3. Ooh, I want a shot at that TOG. You know, you can't have a TOG and not shoot it. I'll even shoot it when it's dead. Okay, now I might be able to achieve something. And I killed something. Wow. I'm impressed. This talk is still alive. I oh know, they just took him out. <laughs> Bloody togs, eh? Alright, now it's a pretty close game. Um, I'm worried about where all these mediums have gone. OK, 
because and I've only done 11, uh, 19 damage and I'm I'm, I'm thinking bloody hell um, there's no arty so that's good do they have a no they just got mediums so what I'm going to do like, it's pointless for me to go and try and defend a base because you can guarantee that's where they're going they're probably going as a group can we see them? yeah they're all over, all over there so those guys are going to have to do that what I'm going to do is try and force their hand because you know I'm a really good player and all I'm going to try and force their hand by going to the base and capping because this is too close to call at this stage and I'm too slow to do any other useful contribution but I am not going to show myself until I get right to the base um, hopefully there's nobody over here and I don't know what he's bloody pointing at on the map for does that mean there's one behind the building that he knows of? Is there? No, no. There's a Lee. I am not afraid of a frickin' Lee. Oh shit! Oh well, <laughs> I'm a numbnuts. I'm a complete retard. I should have actually known that, yes, they would have been defending their base. I thought, foolishly, that they were all the way down in the bottom corner. And now I've probably just cost us the game. But I honestly thought that they had all chased chased down to go to our our base. Um, I think that was an honest mistake. I don't know what my team thinks. Nobody's yelled at me. That's a that's a change. Let's see what's going on. I'll keep this game going because I want to play it one more time after this. So we'll just see what's going on. Uh, the T sixty seven. Nice nice little thing. What are they doing? And the OI is doing what? What's he got on his plate? Nothing. And I wouldn't go over the bridge, mate. That's just my preference. I, I prefer to stay in deep areas and avoid direct line of sight with things for as long as possible until you absolutely need to show yourself. But that's just my preference. I bet you he's a better player than me. What? No, we won't go and have a look at his his play. That that's rude. And what's the T thirty four eighty five doing? This is quite a cool little tank. I I think. Yeah, it's all right. I prefer the um, T dash thirty four on its own, especially with the fifty seven millimeter. It's bloody nice. I really like it. It's it is one of my favourite tanks. Um, I don't do very well in it, but that's generally because I get really aggressive in it and do stupid things. So, what is everyone doing? What are you doing? I don't know quite why you're all... Oh, yeah, I can see, maybe. Here's me and my wreck of a Matilda in the middle of the thing. Take out that Lee. I mean, I, I shot him, but... Mm. This thing is so fast. The Lee and the OI, I mean, it's, there's no contest. The Lee is, I have to say, one of the worst tanks I've ever played in the game. I, I really don't like it. Okay, so why are you just sitting there getting bloody behind a bush or something? Come on. Oh, you are. <laughs> Okay, the OI. 
Now this is looking pretty good. We might get a win here. The Cromwell could wreck the OI if it gets a chance to get around behind it. But who's? No, I think the, I think we've got this game unless someone does a complete muppet move, which I don't think they will. They all seem reasonably good players compared to me so you know I'd probably lose the game at this point I really would I'm just I'd do something absolutely stupid like try and go into the cap circle and get killed by three enemy tanks at the same time oh hang on I just did that didn't I ha <laughs> anyway so they've got a stock T3485 I love that little mod that tells us that it, they've got the stock gun and we've got that Cromwell. Now, yeah, you don't want to be turning sideways like that. <laughs> don't show them the flank. Um, that was good aiming, even by my standards. So, we're down to one. I think we've got this. <laughs> I'd be very surprised. Alright, so second win of the night, but that one I'm I'm going to be in the bottom five, I can guarantee it. That was a terrible performance by me. Let's have a look. Yes, yeah, certainly no mastery from that one. Oh, you're joking, I did. <laughs> I got a mastery badge from that. Yeah, down the bottom. Sad, sad, sad smells. Sad smells, but I still made money. Um, okay, we're just going to jump in for number three. Number three. Here we go. So where will we end up this time? Abby. Now, this can be good in the Matilda. I sometimes quite like it. Mm. It can be a nice, a nice place to take a Matilda um, but it's very dependent on what your team does and where they go so where are they gonna go I don't want to go on my own I would rather maybe follow these heavies stay quite far back and and use my fairly accurate fairly fast firing gun oh awesome Okay, so each one is going to go the other way and the other way. So, yes, I think we will follow them. I prefer going into the valley valley rather than the part where they can fire across from the far end. The reason being is if they've got a nice snipery type tank and they light you up, there's nowhere for you to go. Whereas at least you can hide behind corners and stuff. But I just can't believe how slow I am compared to these two big heavies. I mean, look at them. Uh, I don't quite know what the Panzer 3-4 is doing there, but oh well. Each to their own, I guess. He should probably be supporting the other heavy on the other side, in my opinion. Oh, there's a French heavy sitting in the middle there all good oh is that on this side no what am I doing what a retard it's over the other side I thought I could get some sneaky shots in but knowing my luck it will be I am so slow that I don't get any shots and that would be really embarrassing. I mean, that would be so embarrassing. But not uncommon in the Matilda. You can have some wicked games in the Matilda, and then you can have games where you just don't get anything done and end up as the very bottom on your team because you made a wrong decision. And can we fire? No. 
Cool. Oh, oh, oh. No. Come on. Let me at least shoot something. Come on. Stop firing. And let me shoot something. No. I can see you up there. Uh, they've got that. They've got that. Yeah, they've got that. See, this is going to be one of those games where I don't do anything. What a disappointment. Last game, I think. Well, I mean, we're already winning 8-0. There's going to be nothing left by the time... Is it 9-0? There's not going to be a damn thing left for me. I'm not going to get a single shot off at this rate. The mill Tilda Black Prince. No, he's gone. 10-0. Um... Okay. Come on. There must be something for me to shoot. Seriously. No. 11 1. Oh well. I mean, they did. It's not a down trail for them. I guess that's something. Oh, this is so disappointing. But it is what it is. You get to see me driving around being. A nothing. <laughs> Absolute nothing. Um, 14 2. Yeah, I'm not. I mean, I can't get over there. I'm almost at the point where I might as well just not do anything. Because, you know. And there we go. That is it. 15 2. And I didn't fire a single shot. How disappointing. But, you know, we've got these things. Obviously no mastery badge on that one. And I can guarantee, absolute guarantee, I'm a... Oh. How is it that I did not get at the very, very bottom? Not by much, but hey. Huh. Okay. And as you can see, no shots fired, no damage done, how embarrassing. But a win is a win in the Matilda. You have been watching Smellbad's Gaming. If you liked this video, except for the last battle of course, please do hit like and subscribe if you'd love more content like this. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you very much.